Welcome back to Balloon Animals with Mike Alpha. Now we're going to make a catfish. Uh, this is one of the only designs that I actually created from scratch. Um, there's only two original designs that I have that I haven't uh, learned from another twister. And this is one of them. The catfish and the other one is the shrimp. Most of my other designs I've learned uh, off of YouTube and uh, some of them I've um, I've modified to make them my own, but generally I learned them off of YouTube. But this is the first one that I created. What you need is two gray balloons blown almost all the way up with about a two finger tail. You need a, a blue. Um, this is a robin's egg blue and you can use a, a tropical teal. You want kind of a, an off color blue. This is going to be for the, uh, the mouth of the catfish. Two uninflated black balloons or dark balloons of whatever color you have. Uh, this is going to be for the, the uh, catfish fins. And a scrap of a white, or you could use a five inch round, just, is, just for the eyes. So, start with about, about a hands width bubble. Then bring it down, make it up another side, uh, another same size bubble. and lock the nut around that bubble and push it through. Then make another bubble the same size. And then do a um, three bubble roll through. like that. Then with the rest of your balloon you want to make another three, uh, three bubble roll through. And just make a small bubble at the end. And roll it through like that. This gives us our basic body. This is the head, this is the, uh, the tail part of our catfish. With your other gray balloon, we're going to make our fins. So make a flower petal about a hand's width. Push the through. Then make another flower petal the same size. And take this and connect it here at the joint between the head and the body. Now come down and make another bubble the same size as these and twist it into this bubble at the end. Then with the rest of the balloon, you can make a small bubble, connect it here at the tail. And then just split this in half and make two full twists out. So 
this gives us our basic um, body. With the blue, you want to take and push this through one of these bubbles in the head. Just like that. And make a small bubble here, just a little bit wider than that bubble in the front. Then we're going to come across the front here. And make a little bit longer bubble to go around that front bubble. It's going to be a little bit longer than the bubble that's tucked inside the head. And twist it off there. And tie the knot into that twist. Push it. Push the knot through to lock it. Then come back across the front with about another uh, same size bubble as the one you just made. This time you want to tuck it inside of here to lock it into this joint. But be careful not to pull it too hard or the friction will pop one of these balloons. That gives us the, the front of our catfish, the mouth. The rest of this you can break off and tie a knot here. Then with your two uninflated black balloons, you want to tie these in to the joints on each side of the mouth. And tie it into the knot that's sucked over from your um, from your blue balloon. So I'm going to take this blue knot and tie it around these, these, um, this black balloon. Same thing on the other side. Now take your scissors, and if you have a if you have a lot of this blue knot hanging out, you can snip it close to your uh, knot with the black balloon. Same thing on the other side. So after you uh, snip the knots of the blue balloon and you just want to pull your black balloons together and cut off the ends evenly to take off the, uh, the end of the balloon and the, the knot. This just makes them uh, the same on both ends and it makes sure there's no uh, air trapped inside of the tail. Then we took a scrap of a white Made two eyes, twist it into the top of the head. Uh, be careful when you do that because when you push the balloons through here, um, if you have too much friction going on in here with all these balloons together, one of them will end up getting weak and uh, it'll have a small pinhole and deflate. This happened to me a few times. 
So there's our catfish. If you want to, you can draw some uh, details, some stripes, or some scales on the sides.